another Formula One race weekend has come and gone. And unfortunately, the 2019 French Grand Prix was, well, a test of will, really. Trying to stay awake whilst watching that dross was almost impossible. But why is that? The Magni Corps circuit isn't the most exciting circuit in the world. The blue stripes are meant to be a sort of substitute gravel trap, being a more adhesive than the normal tarmac, slowing cars down. But without the gravel trap actually being there, there's no real sense of danger for drivers. And there isn't many overtaking places on that track. So the only overtaking you see is the DRS zone, which is far too powerful. However, I watched the first Formula 3 race at the weekend, and that did have exciting moments when the Formula 1 race did not. There's mostly a procession throughout the whole race, with the Hamilton leading the way and not being seen by anyone throughout, and not being challenged whatsoever. The only excitement came at the end, with Lando Norris struggling with his hydraulic problems and falling back at the end, unfortunately. And even then, Daniel Ricciardo was penalised anyway, so it was a sort of a missed opportunity for Formula One to prove that it's not a waste of time. But the lack of overtaking and even just general challenging for positions in that race was a symptom of the modern F1 problem, where the racing is just not very entertaining to watch. It's constantly the same drivers finishing in the same positions, and this is by far the worst race, probably for a few years. So whether you blame the track or just the way Formula 1 is nowadays, with the aerodynamics and the inability to follow each other on the track, the lack of overtaking or you know even the odd crash or something just to liven it up, there was one retirement from this race, and that was Grosjean right at the end. As it is, we wait for the next race and hope it's more exciting to watch. But in all honesty, if if nothing happens, then people will start to question why they watch Formula One, especially as Formula E was a lot more interesting this weekend. The burn race in Switzerland had its moments and unfortunately another red flag. But it was still exciting racing where Cars could follow each other closely and try to overtake. The track's a bit too narrow, which I think is a common problem in Formula E, where some of the tracks are great and some are ill thought out. But I think Formula 1 needs to look at Formula E and work out what it can borrow from that sport to make it more interesting. And hopefully, when the 2021 regulations get announced, they'll have some new ideas. But Formula 1 relies heavily on gimmicks with the DRS and the curves and whatever else. So it'll be interesting to see what we introduce. But that being said, I don't think I could watch another race like Mackinac Calls without falling asleep. It was basically a sleeping aid. They could repackage it and sell it in hospitals. Anyway, why don't you leave a comment below with your thoughts on the race and the status of Formula One in, it, in the world of motorsport and just the general standing of the racing general standards I mean not standings but as it is it looks like Hamilton's going to romp home to another title and nothing really interesting will happen